Hello and welcome to Survival World. Today we're going to be learning how to tie the barrel knot. The barrel knot is a friction knot and it is often used as a stopper at the end of lines. It can be used to stop the ends of a line from fraying, it can be used to stop things from coming off the line. The double barrel knot, which we'll be going over later in this video, is a common knot used in climbing. And the barrel knot is also one half of the double fisherman's knot. Start by taking the running end of your rope and pinching where you want the barrel knot to be. Take the running end and wrap it behind the standing end to create a second loop. Pinch both with your fingers and then take the running end behind the standing end one more time and go through the two loops that you just created. Pull the knot tight, dress it, and there's your barrel knot. Again for repetition, start by pinching where you want the barrel knot to go and wrap the standing end behind the running end. Make a second loop, pinch that as well, wrap it behind the standing end again, and pull the running end through the two loops you just created. That's all there is to the barrel knot. Some people like to create the barrel knot using their hand. Personally, I think it leaves uh, too much slack in the line and makes for messy knots, but it's an easy way to remember. You can see there, it's kind of hard to dress the knot when you're done, but it does work. All right, now we're gonna show you the double barrel knot. This is more commonly used in climbing. It's not a knot I use very often for anything I do. Start by making the, the normal barrel knot and just add a second loop to it. So pinch all three loops and take the running end and go through the loops pull tight. Make sure that nothing, that the knot is dressed right and you've got a nice double barreled knot there. Go one more time again for repetition. Pinch where you want the knot to go. Go behind, take the running end behind the standing end. Pinch the second loop. Do it again. Pinch the loop. Now bring it behind the standing end one more time and pull the running end through the loops you just created. And you double barrel knot. Again, people like to do this with their hand. I think it's probably easier on bigger rope for climbing. Again, not something I do, but I think it's harder to make a clean knot using your hand. As you can kind of see as I pull this off here. And there is your double barrel knot. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe to Survival World. Check us out at survivalworld.com.